At tonight's Batavia Village Council meeting, we are learning that the proposed housing development is actually shrinking from right under 800 homes to 668 homes. Still, some residents are voicing their concerns about the impacts these new houses could have on the village. You need jobs in this town, not more houses. The public comment portion at Tuesday night's Batavia Village Council meeting had a few heated moments. My taxes are going to go up. You're going to have all these new people coming to this town. If you guys really want to do something, get off your ass and bring in a, some jobs. The council is in the process of making an ordinance that would change the zoning for potential residential development located on annexed land between Clough Pike and Taylor Road from industrial to planned unit development. The housing development is now proposing the construction of 668 homes, 345 of which are single family lots and 323 are townhomes. The total number is down from the previous proposal of 794 homes. That shows a 5.33 units per acre to a 4.45 units per acre. The residential development is zoned as a community reinvestment area, meaning it's possible for those future residents to make payments to the village in lieu of property taxes. The village council says CRA has been used in two other developments, but it hasn't been decided on just yet for this new housing development. I think because we've done it before, it was just part of the package as we went along, but it is something that we are going to discuss. As we move forward. If the CRA is in fact used, that means essential services like the fire department and the local school district may not see any tax revenue. I've got three kids, all under five years old, that are getting ready to enter Batavia schools right here. Now, it's pretty obvious none of these people up here are interested in collecting real estate taxes. Now, regarding that zoning ordinance, tonight was a continuation of the first reading, and the council will have to go through three readings before they can hold a vote. Their next meeting is scheduled for October 28th. Reporting live in Batavia with photojournalist Christopher Waldman, I'm Chancellor Wynn, Fox 19 Now.